Hey, John here. I wanted to throw together a quick status report on the VDP board. I just finished testing the joystick interface. Everything on the VDP board works. There's been some wiring issues. I'm going to upload the Gerber files for the Rev1 uh, version of the design, which is going to be the as-built schematic of what I have on the bench right now. There may be a future release because there's a discussion that has already begun on YouTube that says, you know, hey, maybe your video output amplifier would work better and have less noise or higher quality or whatever if you do this, that, or the other thing, okay? So that may happen down the road. But as it is right now, I've got color. The software from the retro board does work. I can take control over the chip. I have the joystick inputs working. It generally works, okay? The video quality, in my opinion, is already better than anything I remembered using when I was in high school, circa 1979, 1980, or even, you know, Vic 20s and 64s in the in the 80s. So it's certainly got the retro vibe going on. It's good enough, in my opinion, to be working on some software. And it might be, who knows, maybe a little bit of charm if it's not perfect, right? Um, my point of bringing all that up is there may be a Rev 2 if someone comes up with a, you know, noticeable improvement over what we've got right now. As it is, I think it looks pretty darn good. It's going to be posted on GitHub as Rev 1 by the time this airs on YouTube, which should give you enough time if you want to try a build during your holiday break. You have the time to order your boards, get the parts in, and sit down in order to, you know, spend a nice afternoon in your own nerd cave between the 150,000 social events that you'll otherwise be <laughs> dealing with during the holidays as well. So, happy holidays. I'll see you on the internet.